So I decided to uh, create a video on how to update the firmware on my mobile hotspot. I've uh, started the video uh, close to the end because uh, unfortunately the speed that I get isn't um, fast. So I've downloaded it and I'm using my computer to update the software. Uh, to do this, I log into uh, my router, which is 192.168.1.1. And once I've logged in, I click on the settings, and then I select the firmware. And within the firmware, uh, there was a check for updates here. I clicked on it, and it found the update, and it started to uh, download it. Okay. My options at this point is either I can update it or postpone it. For now, I'll postpone it and I'll specify it for, actually, I'll cancel that. I'll apply the update. One thing with uh, applying the updates for firmware uh, for this mobile hotspot is you have to make sure that the battery is fully charged or as charged as possible because um, it won't let you uh, update the firmware if it isn't charged and on uh, my uh, hotspot I've also plugged it into the AC adapter as well so I'm gonna click on update here and one thing you should be aware of when performing updates is that um, normally these updates work without any problems but occasionally you might have problems with it so my suggestion whenever uh, the manufacturer releases a firmware update that you don't apply the update right away you wait a few weeks or a few months and then you apply the update so I'll click on update and see what happens So now it says it's updating, uh, shows when it was last checked. Okay, and this shows that uh, my router is restarting. And it's still updating. Okay, I'm going to stop this video and resume it uh, once uh, the update has finished. On the router itself, you'll notice that uh, it is updating and it shows updating device, please do not power off. And the bar is increasing, but it's increasing uh, somewhat slowly. So, um, We'll just wait a few minutes and see what happens. After it updates, the router should restart and my computer should automatically reconnect to it.
So I'll uh, pause this video and I'll resume. Actually, it's uh, almost finished now. It's updating. The bar is close to the end. And now it's rebooted. And it takes a while for it to restart. Um, basically, while it's restarting, just this is my antenna uh, cables. This is the AC uh, power that's plugged in, and it's rebooting. I'll just because I have the um, the screen set to turn off after a few seconds to save on the battery life. Um, the screen turned off. I've just turned it back on. It's still rebooting. And should be connecting soon. Let's see here. Okay, so it's connected. Shows it's connected to the FIDO network. And 3G, zero devices connected. Okay, it shows that the uh, broadband has been disconnected. What this normally means is that the APN is not set. So I'll uh, set this on my computer. Let me just turn this back on. Actually, it's back up. It's uh, reconnected. It shows up as FIDO as my connection. So if you have any questions, please post your question below, and I'll be sure to answer it. And if you like videos on technology and on Nikon DSLRs like the D5300 or D5600, please consider subscribing to my channel where you'll be notified of new videos. Thank you.